In this video, let's explore the similarities and differences between Azure Data Factory and Databricks. Let's start with similarities. Interestingly, both Azure Data Factory and Databricks use something called Apache Spark clusters for their data mapping. It's like they have a similar blueprint. They can both handle big tasks like changing data in a flexible way, grouping data together, and moving it around. However, if you peek under the hood, you'll notice that Azure Data Factory and Databricks have some subtle differences. The first difference is the purpose. ADF is primarily used for data integration services to perform ETL processes and orchestrate data movements at scale. In contrast, Databricks provides a collaborative platform for data engineers and data scientists to perform ETL as well as build machine learning models under a single platform. The second difference is in the ease of usage. ADF provides a drag-and-drop feature to create and maintain data pipelines visually. It consists of graphical user interface GUI, tools that allow delivering applications at a higher rate. Databricks uses Python, Spark, R, Java, or SQL for performing data engineering and data science activities using notebooks. The third difference is the flexibility in coding. Although ADF facilitates the ETL pipeline process using GUI tools, developers have less flexibility as they cannot modify backend code. Databricks implements a programmatic approach that provides the flexibility of fine-tuning codes to optimize performance. The last difference is in data processing. ADF and Databricks support both batch and streaming options. ADF does not support live streaming. Databricks supports both live and archive streaming options through Spark API. Businesses often do batch or stream processing when working with a large volume of data. While batch deals with bulk data, streaming deals with either live, real-time, or archive data, less than 12 hours, based on the applications. If you enjoyed this video and found it informative, please consider giving it a thumbs up, sharing it with others, and subscribing to our channel. Happy Azure Engineering!